Hey, Jim McElvain here with Optima Batteries, and we're going to talk about measuring battery voltage. I had uh, the battery on my 94 GMC plugged in overnight, which I do about once a month. I think it's just a good idea to do that, um, just to top your battery off. It's certainly not going to hurt it, um, but a lot of people uh, measure battery voltage in different ways, and I'll, I'll tell you how I do it. I don't know if you knew that or not, but these caps have a little hole in them, so if you have a voltmeter you can go right on those caps and as we look at my voltmeter it measures 12.93 volts um, so because it was just on the charger that's what's called a surface charge so I'm going to turn the headlights on for just a couple seconds to remove that surface charge So I, I ran the headlights for a couple seconds because fully charged the red top will be about 12.6 to 12.8 volts. And this one is back down already and you can see it climbing a little bit, 12.65 and climbing. Um, so the best way to get a good measurement of battery voltage is at the terminals, uh, not inside the vehicle. There could be voltage drop depending on the gauge of cable. And with a voltmeter right here, you can see it measures in at, um, you know, somewhere between 12.6 to 12.8 volts, not the 12.9 that it showed when it came off the charger. And the, the same thing is true when you're driving a vehicle. Um, if you just park the vehicle, it'll have a surface charge on the battery, and you'll, you'll have to dissipate that with the headlights. Or uh, over the next 12 to 24 hours of sitting, uh, the battery will also uh, discharge a little bit and get rid of that surface charge. So this is the best, most accurate way that you can measure battery voltage right here.